Pick a phrase that's rarely heard. Daily word, now it's a daily word. Now it's a daily, now a daily word. Now it's a daily word. Yeah, yeah, what's good, Josh? Your boy Ash Cash. Welcome to November 25th, 2010. Happy Thanksgiving to you and yours. First and foremost, if you don't know who I am, I am Ash Cash, Mr. Daily Word, Mr. Motivation, Mr. Author, My Right, Money Right, all, all, all that above. Make sure you check out www.iamashcash.com. Uh, sign up for the official Daily Word, bright and early, into your inbox. Make sure you start off your day productive. Make sure you start it off in being inspired and motivated. Well, today's Daily Word dedicated to being thankful. You know, I know, you know, 2010, with, with what's going on in the economy, what's going on in the world, I know a lot of people are having ups and downs this year. Or even last year, 2008, when, whenever it started, I know a lot of people are going through trials and tribulations. And I want to tell you, regardless of what you're going through, you got to make sure you're always thankful. You're always grateful. In order to get more in your life, you have to be thankful for what you already have. See, what people start to do, people start to think that, you know, they, they start to wish upon a star. They, they, they wish ahead. They say, you know, I, you know, I'm grateful that in the future, I'm gonna have XYZ. I'm grateful in the future. I'm gonna work hard right now. You know, I'm struggling right now. But in the future, you know, I know, I, you know, they have this hope. We, we, and while it's good to have hope, but that's not the point. You know, life is a journey, it's not a destination. So you have to you have to enjoy the journey. So regardless of what's going on in your life right now, you have a million things to be thankful for. I got I got a saying that I say, and nobody steal this too. If you steal it, make sure you give me credit. It, even when it's all bad, it's all good. Think about that for a second. Even when it's all bad, it's all good. As long as you have that mindset, you will continue to bring abundance into your life because whatever is happening in your life right now, you always have something to be grateful for, always have something to be thankful for. And once you have that mindset, you're gonna continue to attract the things that you want out of life because you are grateful for it. When you're not grateful for it, life is like, all right, you're not grateful, you have abundance already and you're not grateful, so why should I give you more? But when you start being grateful for what you already have, that's when, you know, the universe is gonna open the door, the floodgates are gonna come in, they're gonna say, all right, you know, this person appreciates it, so I'm gonna give more. I'm gonna leave you with one quote, and this quote is from uh, JFK, uh, and this quote, and, th and this, is, this is really about, you know, our actions, and the quote says, as we express our gratitude, we must never forget that the highest appreciation is not to utter words, but to live by them. Very important. It's, it's one thing to say you're grateful, it's one thing to say thank you and, and, and things of that nature, but make sure you're not just uttering words, that they're just not words, that you really live by it, that you really appreciate everything that you have in life, you really, uh, you know, in the bottom of your heart, you really appreciate what you have. And, and, and that's the, the greatest form of appreciation is to, is to live by your appreciation, live by your gratitude, not just uttering the words. I am Ash Cash. Again, make sure you check me out, www.iamashcash.com. Sign up for the official daily word. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow, same time, same place. Peace.